Hello and welcome back to European Universalis 4 to Let's Play as Venice, Merchants of Venice game which is going a bit yeah, meh. I've decided I, I have a problem with these games where I am far too meek, far too just I need to be more bold and go for stuff. So that's why we start on this episode by looking at the Mamluks. They are they're struggling. They are struggling with the Ottomans, and I want Rashid. I really... Do I want Rashid? Yes, I do. Because it has a... I can't get Rashid, can I? No. I can get Dumyat. Doesn't... Do, doesn't have the um, important centre... No, the uh, Nile Estuary. Never mind. I, want, I need to start expanding. I need to start taking places. I've got a good economy going. I'm making uh, nine a month, which at this stage of the game isn't actually that bad. Uh, obviously, as the game moves on, things will increase and you'll start making huge bucks. But, you know, I've been struggling to get anywhere. The Ottomans have got a long way. I've, I've kind of almost got Lyca, almost did this, and Aragon is very big and scary. So, we're ignoring them. We're ignoring Europe. Europe is done. We can't do anything here. We're just going to sit and hope we don't die, basically. We have... We have France as an ally. That is helpful. Gives us some protection. We have Poland as an ally still. They are still not... Um, chance of Poland inheriting Lithuania is still not going to happen. Can we find out when this started? Leeds Personal Union, um, uh, doesn't, doesn't tell me when it started. That's, um, that's annoying. I'd like to know when it started, so I can see when they're going to become, or be able to take it over. Anyway, that's our up. So, I think we're kind of safe in Europe. As in, we probably wouldn't lose too much because of France and Poland, but we might, we're not going to gain anything. This is where we want to go. This, we want to catch a head start in, the, in this area. Terry, Colomito, and it involves taking on the Mamluks, who are, you know, fairly big. We do not have a military. Yet, we're building ships. We have no military at all? No, we don't. We just have our 9,000... Uh, we have discovered that Switzerland has cancelled... Okay. We have... We have our nine men in Cyprus, which have been there for a long time because we're converting very slowly because of our mission. We'll get there one day. We do have another diplomat. I might want to suck her up to Poland a little bit more. Down to 80. We can... Um, yeah, breathe that a little bit more. Um, oh, the knights. They have finally managed to overthrow their oppressors and throw off their shackles. They have declared independence from their former masters of Aragon and are experiencing freedom for the first time in a very long time. Oh. Malta. The knights. Hello. Uh... Hello. Can I? I can't fabricate a claim. No. But uh, they are not in the HRE. So vassalization. In between borders, Venice is a merchant republic. Venetian tax base is good. French attitudes toward Venice is good. Uh, military power compared to knights is good. We could. They're in a truce until uh, only five years. They had the reconquest, Casas Bella against the Ottomans. Uh, good luck with that. Malta. Malta, Malta, Malta. You have a nice little tax base of three. Oh, it's not great, it's not bad. Let's, um. Hmm. What are you doing? You are improving relations in Mecca. Are you? Head Jazz. Mecca. Is Mecca not around here somewhere? Am I totally showing how I'm... Okay, you're allied with them. It must be... Oh. Oh, Mecca's down here. Is it? No. Yeah, there. Oh, I am trying to suck up to 
some people around here for, you know, help. So you'll stay, you are just improved relations. Plus 26. Uh, that's enough for now. Because then you're going to go to Malta. I imagine there's going to be lots of people trying this exact same thing. Do we have another one? They would accept vassalization. So they just got their... Hey, hello. Grandmaster Philippus I. Grandmaster. That sounds a bit... Why can't I... Uh, have a military alliance. Oh, relationship at least 190. That's why. Uh, improve relations. Yes. Um... Oh, I should have done an alliance first. But they would accept a vassalization if I asked. So let's let's work hard on this. Let's try and get this. Try and get Malta, a nice place for holidays. Very lovely weather. Uh, lovely little cities. Yeah, I think it's quite nice. And uh, would that give me? No, unfortunately. It... Oh, I've best an idea. We'll look at it in a second. It wouldn't give me anywhere to claim anything other than. Aragorn, would it? Aragorn. Not Aragorn. Still not Aragorn. He's still not a ranger. Uh, so, mm, it would be nice if I could you know, then do something with this area, but... No. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, got scared then. Suddenly saw... I thought Tunisia had been taken over by the Mamluk somehow, but they're the same colour. It's really awkward. They have lots of similar colours next to each other, like me and all the Ottomans. Tunisia and the Mamluks. Um, Hungary, Poland, Lithuania are all kind of reds. It's not, it's not easy being green. Yeah, it's not easy being green because you can't tell who's who, especially not your colour line, which I'm not. But if I were, then this could be really awkward. Especially reds and greens next to each other. Ah, oh, lost ships. Uh, what was this? I can do a trade idea, which gives me another merchant. Very nice. Uh, it's diplomatic power. What is my diplomatic tech? I am... This gives me a trade depot and a dry dock and longer trade range. But I think... Trade manipulation... I mean, these are really good. So, yeah, I reckon an overseas merchant would be nice. And it, um, national trade income modifier plus 10% works me towards that as well. So, yeah, we'll do that. Another merchant, where do we put him? We got a merchant there, there. Have one in Goose, uh, we have one down here. Can we steer trade from Constantinople? Don't see why not. Uh, we're getting 2.82 going from uh, Wallachia, sending some that way. I am, so how much am I sending? I'm sending two down here. I mean, a lot is coming out this way. I'm going there. But then I'm sending some. I need to I need to get more uh, trade power in Ragusa. But I reckon we will transfer trade power with my new guy from Constantinople. Send him towards me. I reckon that's not a bad idea. But we do need more trade power in the Ragusa trade node. We've only got 20%. Uh, why do we only have 20%? I mean, we've got the biggest, but that's not helpful. I need I need more ships. What were the ships I just made? Uh, ah, perfect. Light ships want to... Um, could you meet up in Dalmatia? Uh, we got another one in Dalmatia. Okay, so we got Venice. Oh, we don't have... This is... Transports. Oh, okay, so we don't actually have... A trade fleet in Ragusa. Which is going to be very important for us. Merge. Uh, protect trade in Ragusa. We won't protect trade here. In our content. We were sending... Put another, what, one and a bit down, and I should... Um, 
Okay. The Ottomans, we're not going to attack the Ottomans. Because that's just rude. Right. So that should improve things in terms of trade. We can build something. I don't have much money. How much are you making now? 8.2. Could be more. And I do need more men. Tunisia has announced Venice as their new rival. Oh. How are we doing with our kind of rivalry thing? Uh, rivals, Hungary, Milan, and the Ottomans, enemies. Uh, now the 100 diplomatic power that remove, requires to remove a rival. I'm embargoing Hungary and Milan. Being embargoed by the Ottomans. I might want to get rid of the Ottomans. And move in, say, I don't mean on Aragon. I think that's scary. The Ottomans are scary. The Ottomans are very scary. Because look at them. Look at them. They're enormous. I should to... Look, we're not doing any wars. Let's speed up to level... Speed 4. Let's just build up our military. Build up our uh, economy. Start building up some shippies. Uh, ships? No, we've got ships. We need more men. Uh, what is that? We have another 15 we can build. So 1, 2, 3, 4. Um, oh, I clicked on them, not them. Damn it. 4... Five, six. Let's get six of them. So that's sixteen. Means I've got another nine left. Need some cannons. Actually, we'll do it. We'll get these done, and then we'll build some cannons. We're in no rush to build up our army. We do want this to go ninety percent, almost there. We want the Ottomans. We want the Mamluks to get in a war, basically, so we can. Attack them. We are going to need some more transport ships, actually. How many? We only have six. Do we? Do you only have six? How do I find out? Where's me? Oh no, I don't. Military tab. Of course. It's not there. It's, um. Um, we'll look at that in a second. Military. We have. Three heavies, 18 lights, 33 galleys, six transports. Hmm. Oh. But we can have a lot more ships. Okay, that's fine. Uh, say it's lived off the contribution there for a long period of time. Now the country's doing so well. well it's not doing badly. Uh, so they're really eager to get cut their cake. It lose two stability. Two? Jesus Christ. Uh, 156 for a stability. I still lose one. Pay them off 156. Would mean a loan. Do we have any loans at the moment? We do not have any loans. Okay. We'll take out a loan. Bit pissed that we lost that stability. Oh, we're going to have to take out two loans. Unless we can last a month. One tick and we don't... No, we took out two loans. Damn it. That's fine. That's not, it's unfortunate, but, you know, it's always going to happen. What are you doing? Oh, you're moving troops in. Oh, can I invest in the card? I'm not investing in any card at all. Uh, Norfolk. Fisher. Uh, Ages. Uh, this guy. DeAndrada. Uh. Whoa. Who are you at war with? You are at war with Papal States in Augsburg. Uh, yes. Both of you, feel free. Have fun. You're going to lose. What is this war? What is this war? Uh, I can never remember where anything is. Current wars. Uh, the second Aragonese conquest of Rome. Oh dear. Aragon are getting a bit big for their boots here. Unfortunately. Um, nothing else really interesting in... Apart from obviously the Burgundian conquest of Calais. Uh, Rome's falling. Wow. I'm gonna have. Aragon will be Italy. I'm getting scared now. Because there ain't bugger all I can do with it now. Uh, okay, recall this map from Head Jazz. 
Would you, um... Offer alliance? Uh, they would. Uh, are they any good? Uh, ledger. Military. H for head to uh, head to this. 6,000, 1,000. Got manpower though. Force thing of 10. Hmm. Better than nothing. I mean, the Mamluks are not exactly powerful at the moment. The Mamluks have 12,000 with a limit of 21. I have better limits, but they are force thing of 32 with Quara Kwaiwuhu. They're the scary ones. And they are. Oh no! No, 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 they're the ones who are allied with the Ottomans. The Mamluks are actually allied with Akhoyonu. Who are. here. And. there's no way they can reach. Really, is there? Because, you know, there's um, the Ottomans in the way. And Al Quarahungulu. So, yeah, head judge might be good. The other one was them. Uh, Oman. Oman is this. Wait a second. You're allied with Quara. Quanalu. You are. In a truce of the Mamlu. Oh, okay, that's a little bit awkward. Who are you? Who's the red? Don't know. So, how can we see this? What are Amman like in terms of military power? Uh, nothing. So, Head Jazz and Amman would cancel each other out. These guys are probably also quite weak. Ak. Uh, they have 2,000 infantry. So yeah, when, when our forces are built up, we can probably go for this. Uh, which they are building up nicely. What is the makeup of this army in Cyprus? It is 6 and 3. It's pretty good. Do need some cannons, though. I'd like some cannons. Uh, one, two, can build two at the moment. Need more money. More money. You need lots more money. I have you are free. Would you? Oh, we have to have a positive opinion of them. Uh, okay. Well, that's not going to happen, is it? Uh, where are you, Malta? Malta, Malta, Malta. You are now at 92. Offer alliance? Yes. Perfect. Yeah, now at 142. Uh, how much further have you got to go? 43. Oh, you're shitting me. That's 85, isn't it? I need another 5 from somewhere. I'm going to need to give them some money. I need to give them a gift when our Dithmar has finished. Conversion successful! Fantastic, we have converted Cyprus to Catholicism, the one true religion. Well done. Still on a roll risk. That should go, because there is no one active missionary. Now we need a new mission. Protecting the Ottomans, improve relations with Ferrara, claim our rebels for Ordnance, Cremona. Uh, no. Uh, Ferrara's opinion is at least 100. Ferrara, where are you at now? Alright, it's easy enough. Send in a diplomat. We got a free one. What do we get? Three prestige? Yeah. Diplomacy. Uh, improve relations. There we go. You, you merge up. Are well, you now? Five and one. Still need a lot more of everything. Uh, back up to sevens. Poor vintage. Oh no! 
Great. Just random prestige drop. Thanks, guys. You are... Cremation from Poland, that's good enough. We could probably stop that. Oh! Oh, God. Um, they desire Venezia. Well, they want everything. They can... Okay, that's not going to happen, is it? Uh, recall death map. That was a mistake. I didn't realise I'd already been improving relations, which means I'm not going to complete that mission for a long time until you know, major stuff changes. Actually, we should probably... Um, tell us about the event of the Iberian Wedding. Where, among the possible options, they want... They tell us about the event, the Iberian Wedding. Where, among the possible options, they went with Let us bind their dynasty to ours. As a choice of their action. Okay. Ottoman has announced Venice as a new rival. Austria has announced Hungary as a new rival. Uh, Papal States... Okay, so what's that done? Castile leads a personal union with... Well, that just got... Awkward. Didn't it? Did it? What does that mean for... Aragorn's diplomacy? Aragorn. Uh, it means you no longer have... It means Hungary is no longer involved with Aragorn at all. Hungary, however, is allied with Burgundy, Milan, Savoy, and Tuscany. So, yeah, it's not <laughs> it's not great, but you know, he's one big power off my back. But it means we might get a big Castile. A very big Castile. We should probably turn to Spain, which is scary. Uh, Sable Island Bank. Oh, nice. Where? Oh, we're actually getting quite a lot of knowledge of this area without actually doing anything ourselves. Well, Norway's tiny. Oh, Norway, come on. Do better. You can do better than that, guys. So, okay, we've got those two. See, where do we want to put out? We don't really matter where we put our troops, does it? Really? At the moment? Because we're not at war, we're not looking to be at war, especially not here. The only places we might be is um, the Ottomans down here, now they've become annoyed with us. Uh, we can build another two cannon. Uh, it's going to be, what, you and you. So that's four cannon. Oh, I'm struggling for money. Down to 5.8. God. We're at 158. Keep going. Candidates life for opportunities. As a republic, we try to strike the balance between economic interest and tradition, of course. We choose our advisors accordingly. Families who know this, tradition and aristocrats alike, try to plan ahead and get their representatives into positions of opportunity before they seek to advise the Ottavio Flangini. Flangini. What's a Flangini? Lovely word. Uh, a position offering such opportunity recently opened, and now different parties are pressuring us for it. There can be no pleasing everyone, and someone has to be appointed. We either lose diplomatic power or military power. We are ahead in military. Diplomatic power would be nice for some... And... Yeah. I prefer traders over aristocrats, to be honest. Uh, the traders... Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, you're occupied by Trier. Poor Switzerland, but I'm having a good time with it. Oh, those cannons came very quick. What do I spend the money on now? Cogs? Probably. Five, one, four. I need probably more cavalry and more infantry. Uh, cogs. How much does cogs cost? Cogs are... Not too expensive. But at least nine. So at least another three more. One, two, maybe two. 
Oh, I've got lots of admin power. What's my next admin tech? The scythe. When do I get my next idea group? Uh, level 10. So I need another two. I do not have any um, administrative ideas, which is a problem because I'm just wasting ad or just kind of accumulating admin power for no apparent reason, which is not ideal. Are you, um, you still at your revolt risk? No. Uh, what have we got? I do not need the army there at all now. Fantastic. Where's this cog fleet? You know, just, just come down. Just um, come down to Cyprus. It's nice down there. My galley fleet, also, you might want to have a little trip down in that direction. Uh, opposing military schools. Lose one. Oh, for Christ's sake. Add plus three a second ago, and I just keep losing. Uh, occasionally hostilities will erupt between opposing military schools. Attack is always the best option. Let them come to us. Increase defence for ten years. Um, ooh! Okay, attack is always the best option. I've got plenty of admin power, so I can... I don't really... Oh, that's not too much of a problem. I mean, look, I had lots. It was just sitting there doing nothing. And I was going to max out before I think I would have got to uh, getting the um, thing. Two more of you. Actually, I probably shouldn't send you. I need to send everyone over to uh, Cyprus first. Uh, what else do we want? More troops. Yes. We got another two of them, please. Oh, advisors died. Oh, um, inflation reduction. Stability. <laughs> ah, great. Now you, Gibeon artist. Theologian. National revolt risk minus three. What is our revolt risk? Crete, one point eight percent. No. Uh, inflation reduction. We do have a couple of, uh, a couple of thingies, a couple of loans out. So they will have a bit of inflation. Not much, but. Never mind. You're still not in a war? Oh, you are in a war with the Timurids and Head Jazz. Ooh. Oh. I... I do not have. Oh, I'd be silly to um come down to the Palestinian coast. If I were, for instance, to declare war, no dude would come. Why would France not come? Distance, they're fighting another war and they've got war exhaustion. But the war they're fighting... Wars... Wars, where are you? Current wars. It, are they attacking? They are attacking. They're losing. Because they're being blockaded, they're winning the battles. But this is the perfect time to strike. And God, I don't have the troops yet. What do the Mamluks have in terms of troops? And are they losing them? Are they... Um, they have 12,000 infantry, 9,000 cavalry, 3... Okay. They've got 24,000 men. Ah, oh, that's frustrating. I can't. I'm not ready. Deandreada has become loyal to me. Fantastic. We can now lock off another guy. Uh, 45. Uh, Zuhusi. I like his name. Zuhusi. Uh, two more cannon. No, two more infantry. Of course, they're infantry. They don't like cannons, do they? Um, okay. Recall the diplomat. We are at 185. Send a gift. 
25. We'll improve the racing by 25. Yes. And then, um, when you're all back, elections! I do not have that I reckon I want. Uh, diplomat? We don't need an admin diplomat, we got text and ideas. So that works. You guys, I cannot. Um, where are you? Rationalization. Uh, 1490... what? 6th of January. 1st of January, 5 days. Improved training! Uh, there is room at the Naval Academy for a new instructor, and the Chancellor has asked us to suggest a course of study to the sailors. Uh, where should we direct the energies of the curriculum? Seamanship. Sip durability goes up. Not really important, because we're not really going anywhere. So there's no attrition we're taking. I, I guess that's attrition. So we'll do um, patriotic curriculum. Vassalization. Yeah, great. We have a vassal. The knights are our vassal. Vassal? Vassal. Uh, with the bishopric of Philippus the uh, first, And we can annex them. Uh... This has been about at least 10 years. Um, and we have. We need to keep it above 190. And we can vassalize them 6th of January 1509. And on that note of actually doing something. My god! What's going on here? We're doing something. This is odd. Uh, this end time is episode 20. So thank you for watching. Uh, come next time when you know, we might actually get into the man looks. Hopefully they'll lose this war. Or at least lose a lot of men doing it, and it'll set them back a bit. So thank you for watching, come next time, and goodbye! <laughs>